welcome back to my channel. Do you like my new backdrop? I showed this to you in one of my previous videos. Um, so this is the nice fall foliage one. So, I'm here to do another Timu haul. Um, we are currently at this very moment under a tornado watch. No, sorry, not a watch, it's a tornado, a tornado warning. So if all of a sudden I take off in a sprint, you know why. But anyway, I've already opened up the package. Here's my Timu package. I've been noticing they've been coming in white packages lately. So apparently, let's see, it was 25. So apparently there's 34 items in this bag. All right, so we're gonna get started. First item I'm gonna pull out is, oh, this is cute. And I just happen to have a little USB here to show you. This is a little USB Astrolite. And let me see, I wanna tell you how much it cost. Let's see. All right. USB. Where the heck is he? Oh, here he is. So it's a little tiny nightlight. Super cute. Hold on one second. Sorry about that. Little baby girl wanted to come and say hi. Huh. She had a nice day today. She went to her doggy daycare this morning. And then her Nana and Grampy picked her up and brought her home. And then Daddy got home early today. So she's had a good day, huh? You're a good girl. Okay. All right. So I'm going to continue on here. I was about to show you the Astro... What's it called? The Astrolite. So it's a little astronaut. You can see that. It's a little astronaut, and he comes on this movable, like, kind of like a wire, I guess. But we can plug him in here to this USB. Let's see. Let's see. And he lights up. <laughs> Isn't that fun? And then this, you can adjust. You can have it look like he's floating in the air. You could have it closer so that it looks more like it's sitting down. Whatever you want to do with it. But it's very cute. And when it's dark, it does let off quite a bit of light. So it's a very cute little night light. I should have probably gotten one of these for my nephew Silas because he is fascinated with space and the planets. And I asked him what he wanted to be when he grew up. And he told me he wants to be an astronaut, so. I don't know if I'm crazy about him being an astronaut, though, because that would mean he's going, he goes out into outer space. Maybe just work for NASA, work in the space program or something, where his feet are still on the ground. Anyway, this is really cute. This was, I think it was, I think it was on one of those um, anniversary deals. This was this was a dollar sixty nine. Cute, and I think it was was it a dollar sixty nine when I bought it. Oh my goodness, my brain. Let's see order information. Here we go. Okay, yeah, it was $1.69, it's still $1.69, but isn't that really cute? I love it. Anyway, let me unplug it and it turns off. All right. Next up, okay, this is a five slot cable clip. So it's really good to put this on the side of your, um, like your nightstand. Um, it holds and keeps the cords organized. It also can hold them so that they sit at the top of your nightstand, but so that's it. It holds five cables. It's got a little sticky, you peel this thing off in the back and it's sticky 
so it can stick to the side of your nightstand. And it will hold all of your cables in place so that everything stays organized. Sorry for the shadow. I mean, it's awfully, this new light is awfully bright. Let me see if I can dim it a little bit. Eh, that's a little bit better, right? So yeah. So it's a five slot cable organizer. And that was, this was $3.29. It has now gone down in price, so it's $1.11, so I will get the credit difference on that one for sure. Okay. Next up, oh. Next up, I got another pair of um, the Blue Blocker eyeglasses. Hey, crazy girl. My little crazy girl is making a ruckus over here again. That's what she does. So these are the blue blockers. I really like the blue blockers. And I actually really like the style of these. I already have them in pink, so I ordered a couple more pairs. So these were $2.98. They come in a little, little case. Probably gross. All right, so these are the yellow. They're really cute. I like the style. And I got the 2.0s because, you know, the older I get, the worse my eyes get. But. Cute, right? I like them. So they've got the yellow here. And I like that they have this open frame on the bottom. Yeah, I like them. $2.98. And these are the yellow. We'll put those back in the little case for now because I don't want them to get all scratched. I mean, sometimes I get like um, sunglasses from the dollar, um, eyeglasses from the dollar. Okay, sorry about that. I got cut off because I got another warning for a tornado it's saying, take shelter now. I'm like, okay, well, what more shelter can I take? I'm in the basement for crying out loud. I mean, I got the doors closed. I got Miss Callie down here with me in the basement, so... You know, my YouTube channel is important, so I'm going to continue filming. And if the roof blows off my house while I'm standing here, you'll all see it and you'll be like, wow, that was really cool. Anyway, I'm not trying to make light of tornadoes. That's not nice of me. I'm definitely not making light of tornadoes. They're very scary. There's been a lot of people who have been affected by tornadoes and that sucks. And in fact, when I was a child, I used to have nightmares about tornadoes. Tornadoes are, they scare the crap out of me. So I'm just hiding down here with all, you, with all of you riding out the tornado warning. So I might get cut off again, but. Anyway, I was talking about the, sun, the eyeglasses from the Dollar Tree. I'll buy those sometimes because I am a little bit rough on my eyeglasses. So if they get scratched, it's not that big of a deal. Anyway, all right, next up we got, this is a really cute little hair clip. This was 98 cents. That's really cute. It's a little heart. So it's a little heart, it's a little heart hair clip. So you clip it in the back of your hair, and you've got a little heart. This one came in a ton of different colors. Um, so it came, and this is the, I think this is the khaki. No, this is beige. No, I'm sorry, this is coffee. Then they have beige, blue, green, purple, dark green, or you can get a two pack of beige and blue for $3.38, but you're better off just getting one for 98 cents. No, I'm sorry, 89 cents, did I say 98? Well, I bought it for 98, but now it's 89. So I'm gonna get the difference of 10 cents on that one too. Okay, next up. Okay, I actually got two of these. I got one for me and I got one for mom. This goes on your 
countertop next to your stove to um I'm such a hard time and I should you know I should have priced it all beforehand but I don't do that because I like to make things more difficult so this one was all right so anyway it is a little um thing for the side of your you put it on the counter next to your stove and it will hold your little like your ladles and everything and this little area catches all of the whatever you know like if you're mixing pasta or you're making eggs and you want to set your spoon or your spatula or whatever down you can put it here and this part will catch all the ickies and it won't get on your counter so this was I don't know how much this was. Because it's not telling me how much it was. Oh, these were $1.26 each. And I got one for me. And one for mom. Right. Oh. This made me smile. When I, when I saw it, I had to get it. It made me smile. It makes me think of my little Cali girl. Looks just like her. And this was... These are $2.69 for two. You get two of them in the pack. How stinking cute. There's two stickers. They're little stickers. It's my little Cali girl. <laughs> $2.69 for a two pack. Love that. So cute. Boy, they sure do fit a lot of stuff in here. Okay, next up, this is a puppy chew. I am gonna take the, the bell out of this. So this is a three pack, $2.24, you get three of them. It has a bell in there. The bell is coming out because she will get that bell out. I'm gonna have to have Ed help me get it out because she'll get the bell out and she'll choke on it. So we're gonna remove the bell. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stuff it with her food. Like, cause I think I explained to you before in a um, video that I feed her, um, I cook her food for her. And then I, so I, I feed her like ground beef, ground turkey, ground chicken. Excuse me. I feed her ground beef, ground turkey, ground chicken with different vegetables, like um, carrots, peas, green beans, um, broccoli, you know, all the healthy stuff. And sometimes I'll take some of that mixture and I'll put it in the blender and make a paste. And then I can stuff these and put them in the freezer. She loves it. Keeps her busy. Um, tires her out. She loves it. So the bells have to come out of these, but they're cute. Pink, blue, and yellow, or like a yellowish green. $2.24 for the set of three. Just got to get Daddy to take the bell out. Next up we got, oh, this was good. I saw this and I was like, yep. Got to have this because a lot of people need to remember this. It's a sticker. It's $1.78. Still a dollar seventy-eight. Louder for the people in the back, perhaps. Equal rights for others does not mean less rights for you. It's not pie, people. She's mad because I locked her in here. Callie, you have to stay in here, baby girl. You have to stay in here for right now until. The tornado warning is over. You have to stay in here with mommy. Because if a tornado comes by and you're upstairs, I can't get to you quickly. You have to stay here. She's mad. She, I've got another warning here. What is that one? Tropical storm watch. Good Lord. Anyway, I saw this and I had to get it. I'm like, yeah, because a lot of people, they just, they don't get it. Like, Giving equal rights that we all have to other people in like the LGBTQ community. It's not taking away your rights, peeps. 
It's just giving them rights, which they should have automatically anyway, as human beings. Here I go on another rant. But anyway, I got this sticker. It's a good motto to list by people. Anyway. Okay. Oh, all right. So these are, um, these were in the last pack. Let's see right here. These are skin tag patches. So I get skin tags. I don't know if maybe some of you get them. They're just little, little bumps on your skin. These are skin tag removers. So you put this, you put it over the little skin tag and Hey, no, get in your bed. You put this over the skin tag, and I'm not sure yet how long you leave them on. They don't have to read about it. But you leave it on for a little bit, and supposedly they're supposed to fall right off. So we're going to give it a shot. Get 144 patches in there, so we'll give it a try and see how it works. Maybe I'll share them. I think my dad gets... I, I, I'm like my father in the sense. I think dad gets some skin tags too. Well, I know he does. So maybe I'll give him some if they work. And let him know. Excuse me one second. Okay, sorry about that. She was having a little conniption. She's probably going to do it again. She keeps banging on the door because she wants me to open the door. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it because I just don't want her to be upstairs at the moment because yeah, I just got it again. Another warning. So, no, she's not going up the stairs. She can whine and complain all she wants. All right, so next up, this is for Christmas time, but it's super cute. This was $2.97, and it's still $2.97. So it is. it goes on the corner of your door. So you put, you put Santa on the corner like this, and then you put this on the top. So they sit on the corner of the door. Isn't that cute? Really, really cute. This kind of snaps together right here. And it just sits on like the door frame of the door. I thought it was cute. It'll be fun for Christmas time. I'll probably put it, um, I have like a closet door in the, the living room area. I'll put it on the corner of that. It'll be very cute. Excuse me. Excuse me. Are you trying to eat that? Are you trying to chew on the door? Or the door frame? No, we're not going to chew on the door frame. You're going to have to wait. We're going to have to wait. I think I just got another tornado warning. What does that say? Great. Hold on a second, peeps. Yep. U.S. National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning. It will be in effect until 5.45 p.m. It is currently 5.28 p.m. So, what the heck? Hold on a second. Okay, so, it's the same thing. It's, they keep, it's just that they keep extending it. So, I, I mean, what more can I do? I can't go outside. I can't run. I can't, I can only be here. And of course, Ed went to the gym. Callie Rose, you stay. Just lay down, please. Don't, oh, don't you give me, don't you give me back talking, lady. I'm almost finished. Anywho, so this, what did I say that was? 297. Very cute. I'll put that up at Christmas time. Like it. Love it. Very nice. Okay. Well, they should have said a lot in here. What is this? Oh, this is a cute little makeup organizer or makeup brush organizer. Hey. All right, so. This was... So this, I guess, you put this one here, right? Oh, I 
I see. Yeah, right. It's like rocket science again for me to try to put things together. <laughs> so this little thing was 34 cents. I mean, you can't go wrong for 34 cents, right? It's just a little spot to hold my makeup brushes in my on my vanity. It's not fancy by any stretch of the imagination. It's just convenient. So this goes like this. And then I guess you just decide which ones you want to pop it into, right? Yep. Oh yeah, it's fairly simple to put together, so. Yep. Yeah. So there you go. So you put all your little makeup brushes in here. You could probably put like little eyeliners and stuff in there and that will hold your makeup brushes. 34, 34 cents, I mean. Oh, well, I got it for 34 cents on a lightning deal. It's now $1.59, but I mean, there's a picture of it here and it's like jam packed. They've got it jam packed with brushes there, see? But yeah, perfect. Exactly what I needed to organize all of my makeup brushes. All righty. Next up. So when I was younger, these were very, very popular. And especially if, if you have curly hair, putting your hair up and, you know, having your curls cascade is really, really nice. They look nice. So I used to use these when I was younger, but they're back in, they're back in fashion. They're called banana clips. I think they look nicer on curly hair than they do on straight hair, but that's just my opinion. You know, we're all entitled to our opinions, but see, so you put your hair in and then you clip it. And so basically it would make my curls just sort of cascade. It would look really pretty. Um, like if you're going out for an evening or um, on a cruise or something like that, it'd be really cute. Okay, baby girl, why don't you lay down? Go ahead and lay down. Thank you. But anyway, so it came, you get six in a pack for 58 cents. So I was like, yes, please, for 58 cents, you get three brown and three black. Okay. Three brown, three black. It's not 58 cents anymore, sorry. It's $2.07. I got it on a lightning deal. But even still, $2.07 for six. That's a pretty good deal. Because if you were to go to like Walmart or Walgreens or um, CVS or something and you bought banana clips, you probably get one, maybe two, for probably like five bucks, so. Anyway. All right, next up, I got another hair clip. So the last one I showed you was a heart. This one is a little flower. There we go. This was 98 cents. And now it's a dollar seven, but here it is. It's a little flower. So it clips on your hair and you've got a little flower sticking out. I would put it in the back, but really cute. So yeah, that was, I paid, I paid 98 cents, it's now a dollar seven, and this is navy blue. Let me see, because I know I got another one. Oh, here's the other one. And I also got it in green. The green, I got it for 57 cents. And now, it's 97 cents. So. But, Here it is in the green. Okay. Really cute. I just thought they were fun. Very fun. Okay, next I got 
this is a little, it's a little smaller than I thought it was going to be, but it's a little brush to sort of comb out the hairs on your hairbrush. Oh, how much did I spend on this one? Of course, I'm on the wrong one. See, they basically, they took, I ordered, I put in two orders. They were like three days apart, but they shipped it all together. So I have to kind of go back and forth between the two orders. So this is the little brush. No, okay, yeah, see? It's like a little rake for your, um, for your hair brush. Okay, 44 cents. Again, it will rake the hairs out. I don't know how, I mean, I don't know how sturdy that's gonna be. It's pretty flimsy, so whatever. So 44 cents. Oh, okay, and I needed one of these. So last trip, I had one of these. I bring me one of these with me because I'm blind as a bat. And when I try to do my makeup in the morning, I cannot see. I have a magnifying mirror that is on my vanity, but it's too big for me to take on vacation. So, oh, they wrapped it really well too. I don't know if I can get this open. Let's see, I got a razor blade here. Of course, you're probably looking at me with this dang razor blade and you're thinking to yourself, girlfriend, you better be careful. I know. <coughs> oh, excuse me, all right. Anyway, <coughs> excuse me, because I am blind as a bat, I have to bring one of these magnifying mirrors with me on vacation. This one was, how many? This one was on the other order, of course. I'm back and forth, back and forth. All right. This cost $1.34, and this one is 15 times magnifying, so I can really, really see my eyes. I need it for doing my eye makeup. The last one I had, I left it stuck to the mirror at the hotel room. So, ordered myself a new one for $1.34. Used to be able to get the magnifying ones at the Dollar Tree, and now all they have is just the regular, it's just, it, it looks just like this, but it's not magnifying. I need magnifying for my old lady eyes. Okay. All right, next I got, this is for my bathroom. And actually, I would probably bring this on vacation because we like to leave a little thing of soap on the counter at the hotels and stuff. This was $1.88, and it's a little soap holder. Holds a bar of soap. I could probably use it in my bathroom just to kind of keep, so you don't keep the soap on the countertop. Don't like that. It leaves a film. Callie Rose. No, you have to wait. So, dollar eighty-eight. Very cute. Love it. Okay. All right. What have I got here? Okay, I gotta go back. Back and forth. Back and forth. I keep going back and forth between the two orders because, like I said, they ship them all together. So this this next item. These are um. Some little notepads that come in different sizes. You get like a dark pink, a light pink, and a blue. This was 71 cents. It's 90 sheets, sticky notes. I'll bring that to work. I use stuff like that all the time. Hold on one second again. Okay, sorry about that again. Naughty pants. We have a naughty pants. Okay. Oh. Here's another one of these. I got two of them, one for me, one for Ed. I got another one of these. So we'll both have one for our nightstands because Ed has a bunch of cords too. Okay. Next, 
up. Oh, these are cute. Okay. They're a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be, but they're little night lights. Again, with my night lights. I'm just thinking cute though. These would be really good if you have like plugs already in your walls that hold USB, have USBs. It's a little tiny night light. So again, I happen to have a little USB right here. I'll plug it in. <laughs> That's cute. It's just a little tiny night, tiny light bulb <laughs> with a little USB on the end. So cute. That is really cute. I got two of those. Those were 96 cents. So we'll put those there. Next up, I got another package of these. I have some of these already and they're fantastic for holding the Air, Apple AirTags on your dog's collar. Which if you watched my video all about my Amazon haul for Cali, I'll link that video down below for you. Um, I talked about these in that video and her AirTag and how I think keeping an AirTag on your dog is a great idea. But I went into a whole thing about that on my Amazon haul. And again, like I said, I'll link that that video down below for you. But these are AirTag holders. And I bought more, again, in my Amazon haul. I bought um, different colored ones. Of course, they're cheaper here. You get a two pack of them for $2.11. I think on Amazon, I think it was a two pack for like seven, six, something like that. But yeah, so this was a two pack of, they're both black. Which go with which go with everything like all of her collars because if you again watch my Amazon haul video for Callie you'll see she's very spoiled I buy her a lot of stuff okay next up this is sort of a banana clip but not quite it's a stretchable banana clip okay they call it a banana clip it's a stretchable one Let's see if I can get it open okay. So this one I like because, I don't know, it can pull your hair to sit higher because this part is stretchy. Mm -hmm. Cali Rose. Stop having a temper tantrum. I'm almost done. Anyway, so this part is stretchy so it can really pull up a lot of hair. And then you pull it in and these kind of lock in together like this to hold your hair up. But yeah, it's cute. I used to have these when I was younger too. And now I got another one. All right. Next up, what's this? Oh, I think I know what this is. I think this is for my car. I have one in my car currently. And I wanted to get a second one. Yeah. This is the dashboard phone holder. Um... I don't know what the numbers are for on it, but so basically that's that's it here. Now I'm not sure what the phone numbers the, the numbers are for. I guess maybe if you want to put your phone number on there. I wouldn't do that because then you have people calling you. <laughs> um so this part down bottom is supposed to be non-stick, I mean non-slip, I guess. It's a little different than the one I already have, but I'm going to try it out, see what I think. This was $4.49, so the phone sits right like right in here on this little part. Oh, I see. So in case you forget your phone number, you can put your phone number in there. I don't forget my phone number. Maybe some of you do. Ed does sometimes, I think. But anyway, so we'll try that out. $4.49. Great for the dashboard. Oh, I got another backup mirror just in case I end up leaving that one in a hotel room like I did with my last one. Because, you know, sometimes your girl, she just loses her mind. And she forgets things. Now, what the heck is this? Oh, 
this is cute. So this is a little mini razor blade. So you go like this, and there's your little razor blade. How cute is that? So you can use it to cut open your packages. Callie, come here. Up here on the chair. Up on the chair. Sit down, please. Do you want to say hi to everybody again? Come here. Come on. Come here. All right. Say hi to everybody again. I know you're mad. I'm almost finished, and then we'll go back upstairs, and we'll get dinner ready, okay? Okay? You're a good girl. Please be a good girl. I love you. Okay. Sit down now. Sit down, and we'll get snacks in a minute, okay? I'll bring you, to, I'll bring you upstairs and get some snacks in a minute. So, anyway, what was I just showing you? Oh, yeah, I was talking about the fact that I got a second mirror because I forget everything. And what else? What else? Oh, here's the other pair of eyeglasses that I got. Again, what did I say these were? Very reasonably priced. These were $2.98. And these are the pink. No, I'm sorry, blue. I already have the pink. I just showed you the yellow. These are the blue. So, it's a very, very pale, pale blue. But I really like them. Really, really like them. There's the blue. Put them on. Yeah. Got the blue here. The very, very, very pale hint of blue. I like them. I think they're super comfortable. The blue blocker light is really great for if you're on the computer all day, which I am at work. Um, so yeah, I wanted to have a couple pairs, so got myself another pair of those. Okay, next up. Oh. Well, apparently I ordered, <laughs> I ordered more of these, these little, these little night lights. I got four of them. One thing I recommend to you when you're ordering, double check, because sometimes you'll click that you want something, mm -hmm. then you'll click it again. So I obviously put in for two and I must've clicked it twice because I got four, but that's all right. They were only, what'd I say? They were 67 cents a piece, so not a big deal. All right, next up, I got this fabulous bag. Mm -hmm. Callie Rose, I'm almost done, baby girl. All right, I got this fabulous, um, sh it's like a shopping bag, travel bag for the back of the car. $4.79 for this baby, and I just love the print on it. It's so pretty. Let me get it out for you. This is nice. And it zips. Great. So, it's a pretty decent sized bag, right? But you open it up like this. And it zips. Close across the top. Oh, it's a double zipper, too. One thing that I find. One thing that I find with Timu is that all of the zippers on their stuff are really quality zippers. I mean, I don't think, there might have been one or two things that I've purchased in the past that didn't have a great zipper, but for the most part, everything I've gotten has a great zipper, so. I like that. Okay, next up. I got some more of these. Now, I changed my mind on these. Oh, wait, what is this? What is this? I think they might have sent me the wrong thing. What is this? Okay, sorry about that. Sorry for all the interruptions. That was Ed calling. 
I wanted them to pick up something for dinner because I'm filming and I didn't have time to throw anything for dinner and I was kind of in the mood for a tuna sub. So he's going to the sub shop. Anyway. All right. So this I got, I just got this on a whim. I thought it was cute. I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with it, but let's see if I can find it on the list here. It's a, it's a cow and you set it up. So it peeks, it's peeking in the window at you and it's eating bread. <laughs> I don't know. I bought it on a whim. It was a lightning deal. I got it for 48 cents. So I thought, how funny and cute is that? Maybe I'll put it on the, um, the window in the garage. There's, we have two windows in the garage that look into the backyard. And that's like our little seating area out there. Maybe I'll put it in there like he's peeking out the window at us from inside the garage. <laughs> I don't know. It's cute. It was fun. 48 cents. It's now $2.48. So it was a lightning deal. I got it for 48. That's fun. Okay. Next up. So I got two. Now you guys already know if you follow my channel that anytime I buy stuff and I really like something, I also get one from my mom. So, they're both different. These are both a little bit different than each other. Callie Rose. Mommy has two more items to show and then she's done. So just wait a second, okay? And I think our tornado warning is expired. So that's good. So I bought two of these. They're the... Um, they're the crossbody bags. Oh, I just love this. This is so pretty. So it's got, again, great zippers. So it's got a really big interior pocket there. It's got a little button pocket for the front. Oh, and it's got a little built-in area for your cards. This is really cute. This is perfect for um, when we go to Disney because you don't want to carry something big and bulky. And I like it's a double zip. So it, it's got two zips on it. And I also like that you can fasten it the left or the right. Excuse me. Excuse me. She's being really naughty because she's mad at me. She's like trying to get me to be like, get the heck out. <laughs> I think the tornado warning's over. I let her out. Goodness gracious. Anyway, as I was saying, you can fasten it to either the left or the right. So if you want it to cross this shoulder, you can, or this shoulder, which I prefer. I bought one of those Kavu bags. The Kavu bag is not adjustable. It sits on one shoulder all the time. And after a while, you, it kind of bothered my shoulder, especially if you were carrying more stuff in it. And I like to be able to switch it out. Really, really cute. This one cost... All right, this one costs four. Is that right? Fourteen ninety eight. No. No. This one was eight dollars and forty eight cents. Super cute. So I got that, and then I got this one as well. This one was fourteen dollars. But it's like the same color pattern, the same color. The it's a little bit different size wise. Um, if I compare them side by side, size wise, it's a little bit bigger. Yeah, a little bit lighter in color. Um, again, this one you can switch it to either side, which is nice. It's got basically the same um, strap. Um, this one just has a different setup with the pocket. So it's got the, the big interior pocket, and then it's got this outer pocket, which is basically the same thing as that one. And then it's got just a little tiny pocket in the front here. But yeah, they're super cute. So one is going to mom, one is going to me. I'll probably give this one to mom. It's a little smaller, a little more dainty. Like mom, she's, she's petite and dainty and very cute. And I think this one would 
be good for her. So I think we'll give that one to mom. And I think that's everything. That was a good haul. I mean, that was 34 items. That was a lot. And I think they didn't skip anything. I got everything. Yeah. That was everything. Covered it all. So I lived through my tornado warning. I think it's over. I'm not blowing away like Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz. Callie's gone back upstairs now. She's happy and content because she's probably in the front room, sitting on the bed, looking out the window, watching for daddy to come home because that's what she always does at night. So that's probably why she was so upset that mommy was not letting her out the door. I mean, she doesn't understand that there's a tornado warning, so. I get it. She doesn't want to be cooped up in a room down here in the basement with mommy. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd come down here and film with my new backdrops. Um, this backdrop is shorter, so it ends like right here. So that's why I'm doing this one standing, because that way the backdrop is nice and it's behind me. But my other one, my Halloween one, is like taller. <laughs> That's Callie with her squeaky toy. She ran back up the stairs. Um, but my Halloween one is taller. So I can do that one sitting because I'd be like down here sitting. So anyway. Oh, and then on the way home, you know how they say um, one person's trash is another person's treasure? I was driving down the street and I passed by this stool somebody left out for trash sitting on the side of the road. It's really nice. So I turned around and I got it. It needs a little cleaning up and it needs a new cushion on the seat, like a cushion cover, but I can easily do that. Just wash it up and clean it up and I'll have a new stool and I'll probably use that stool here, down here for when I film down here. I mean, I'm still gonna film upstairs in my um, my office up there, but on occasion, for different holidays and stuff, I can come down and film in front of my backdrops. I also have the tropical one, but summer is almost over, so I probably won't use the tropical one until next year, but anyway, I'm rambling. But let me know if you like my backdrops. Let me know if you liked my haul. Is there anything in there in particular that you're interested in? Um, if there is and you want the link, just let me know and I'll send the, the link to it for you. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching my umpteenth millionth haul. I know I've done a lot of them, but I happen to love Timu. So I'll continue to do them again. I'm not sponsored by Timu. I'm just a little fish in a big pond. Um, I mean, I wouldn't complain if I were sponsored by Timu, but I'm not. I buy all this stuff with my own money or credits that I get or whatever. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't yet subscribed, I'd be really happy if you did. It would help me out a lot. Um, if you give me a thumbs up, that would be really appreciated. Thanks again so much for watching, and I hope you all have an amazing day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.